Ah, didn't get me that time. Didn't. I, I absolutely guarantee it didn't get me that time. What a weird... I, mean, so, I love that opening. I really, really love this opening. I think it's really clever to have the silence, to have no like build-up to it, to just have that flash. It's quite clever. It's a clever bit of horror, just like the rest of the game, really. It's so beautifully put together, this one. I mean, this is, as I've said before, this is what I wanted from the original Alan Wake, but kind of didn't really get, you know? Um, I liked the original Alan Wake when it came out, but I only liked it. I didn't love it. It always felt to me like it wanted to be something else, you know, which it did. Of course, we know that when you go back and read the history of the original Alan Wake, we know that it was a very, very for all of the, uh, you know, the, the actual game was loved, it was a massively compromised piece of work. And that showed. That definitely showed. It wanted to be more like this. It wanted to be quieter. It wanted to be more about the horror and less about the action, which is where this game has got the balance right. It's more story driven. It's more character driven. It's got a better script. It's got better direction. It's got better production values. And this one, more importantly, had way more time to develop itself. And the result is something beautiful. In fact, I was reading earlier, my loves, that um, there's a new game plus for this. And when you complete it, if you go back through the game on New Game Plus, there are new story elements and there's a new ending. So we'll be playing this one at least twice. At least twice, my loves. So let's get back to Alan, shall we? He was lost in the the, the sort of in-between, the nowhere uh, when we last left him. Don't know quite what we're doing, but I'm sure we'll find out. Hmm. I've got a cup of tea as well, to calm my nerves in case there are any nasty flashes or whatever. Okay, so, we've got a little, uh, a little home from home here. It's not ideal, as you can see. I bet it smells bad. It looks like it does. But then again, I imagine Alan smells bad at this point too, so it's fine. Return Scratch. Why do we keep seeing that everywhere? And this thing everywhere. That image of the dark man. Very Stephen King, that element. Very Stephen King, and I kind of like it. The darts keep turning up as well. What the fuck is that about? Where well, they have no business being. Deputy Mulligan tuned Thornton's chatter out. Uh-oh, more writing. Mulligan knew he wasn't alone. The sheriff's patience with the Fed was running out. Uh-oh. I love the way this world feels so... Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Yes, I remember where we are now. We're in the subway, aren't we? God fucking damn it. Lost Scratch. Who is Scratch? I mean, I know it's, uh, you know, Old Scratch is an, is an old uh, British name for the devil. I don't think it's literally the devil. This isn't that kind of mythology. But it's significant, you know. It's pointing to what might be true. Um... I mean, whatever's down here is probably worse than the fu oh, really? I was going to say it's probably worse than the fucking devil, and I'm probably right, aren't I? Let's be on. Let's be honest. Uh oh. Nope. Don't like that. Don't like that. Don't write. Like I said before, good general advice for Alan, really. It always seems to go wrong when he does, doesn't it? The darkness is here, look. There's this reality warping shit going on. Which I do not like. Alice is his wife, I think, who was lost at the air, the beginning of the last game. She fell into the lake. Um, she was taken by the darkness. I believe possessed by it, actually. Um, which is not ideal. Hello. Which there are weird sounds around here. Initiation, again. I'm going to go down this way first. I just want to have a look. Because um, look, there's something pointing to treasure around here. So let's just have a peek around. I don't like this. This looks... I think this might be the bound of the story again. Down this way. Because this is technically the way we came from. Yeah, look, there's the edge of the story. So we can't go that way. Ooh. There's more stuff about the cult. 
God, look at all this. It's so weird, isn't it? Lost. Yeah, it's cool though. It's weird, but it's cool. Can I get in here? Oh. It could not be opened on the side. Locked. Stuck. Jammed. And again, Alan's prose, right? It could not be opened on this side. It's like how like a, a teenager writes. You lost her. You did, Alan. You did. Mm. And it was very early on as well, when he did lose her. Ah, so there's there's a treasure. Ah, ha, ha. That's mine. Thank you very much. Oh, I got me a word of power. I bet I'm missing loads of them, by the way. Because they are very well hidden for the most part. Am I going to need them all for the final encounter? Probably. Anyway, let's go level up, shall we? I just love that. The fact that there is a leveling up system. I mean, what the fuck is that about? Oh, there's more stuff to uh, to explore as well. So, what have we got? Words of aid. Okay. Um, Torchbearer. Increases hand flares area of effect. Okay. Increases effectiveness of trauma pads. Uh, uh, words of action. It's personal. Increases damage dealt to enemies. It makes Alan 20% harder for enemies to detect. Decreases damage received from the, dar from the darkness projectiles. That sounds good. I'm going to have that. Have we got anything? Words of stuff! <laughs> Alan, you are... You are not a very good writer. Let's put it that way. Um, increases effectiveness of trauma pads. Increases effect duration of painkillers. Uh, let's have that. Cool. Okay. What else have we got? Anything new here? A new beat for the story. Oh, yeah? What's that? This? Oh, no, fuck, I didn't want to do that. Hang on. I just need to get the, uh... Room! Okay. He will call again. Casey's case. Oh, yeah, part two, Casey. Okay, okay. So let's have a look here. What have we got? Navigating New York. I had to find my way to the subway station. The lamp would make it emerge. I met Casey. He was in this story. This was his city. He talked about a manuscript. It had to be my writing. Casey was killed by the Dark Presence. I had assumed his role. Every writer is the detective finding the story. The Dark Caldera. Uh, some of the places felt significant here. Had I written them into being, I'd use them as a scenes in my story. The station platform was a threshold to be crossed. I saw a vision, an echo of a forgotten idea about a Casey story. A glimpse into another reality. A plot element for this story to travel deeper. Pardon me. Uh, Casey's case. The narrative I wrote to find my way. Casey looking for a missing FBI agent. The agent on the trail of a murder cult. The cult of the word. Hmm. Liminal place. Inspiration for the story. Murder site. A way deeper. Find the right story. Shape the dark place. I mean, that seems to be what the whole game is really about. It's it's Alan trying to like write his way out of this situation to shape the metaphysics of this thing. Um, what's that? I can't really do anything with that at the moment, so... Uh, hmm, there's Caldera Street. There's the map. Anything over here? Not really. Got the radio and the television. Okay, brilliant. I think that's it for us now. We can go back to... Well, I was going to say back to reality, but that ain't right, is it? It's hard to determine... Yeah, thanks, Alan. The trail led me on. Oh, okay. yeah, thanks for that, Alan. I really needed that. Look, I'm not lost. I'm just exploring. I don't want to miss anything. Ooh, there's that weird kind of, like, reality distortion there's called, Casey. You die here. Ooh, no. That's not good. Hello? I definitely heard something then. I don't know what, but I definitely heard something. Ooh, hello. That looks significant. Uh, let me just have a look over here. Then I'll, uh, I'll explore down there. There's more blood over here. So that's the way the game wants us to go. So I'm just going to have a, a sneaky look down here to see what's what. Oh, no. This may not be... There's the cult symbol... 
This probably isn't wise, is it? Let's be honest. Oh, okay. We're going to do this, are we now? The lamp was dead in my hand. Okay. Oh, okay. So we need to find the light and then come back here, presumably. That would be my guess, and this will open the way. That's cool. I like that. There's a light down there. That's where we're headed. All right. What about down here? Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Yeah, that's not great, is it? That's not great at all. I've got fucking got to go down there as well, haven't I? Yeah, I do. I've got to go down there to get to the light. God damn it. I do not like this. Another place to use in the story. I needed to search the tunnels for further visions. Oh, really? For the story that would lead me deeper. You found a new scene. Go to the plot board to rewrite reality in the collapsed tunnel. Okay. I found another compelling location to use. Compelling. I like that. Mm. Okay. Let's have a look. So, uh, this was where the agent's trail went cold. A single plot element can be used in multiple scenes. Select the FBI agent plot element and activate it with X to rewrite reality in the collapsed tunnel. I changed the story. And with that, the dark place changed. Oh, that's cool. I love that. I've got to say, I think that's amazing for the oh fuck. agent had come here looking for answers. All he found was a fate worse than death. A fate worse than death. There we go. Bad luck to be on this case. The cold can get you anywhere with that black magic shit. Ah. What happened, anyway? Some fed came looking for the cult, but it was a trap. A satanic blood sacrifice. Anyone who gets involved with the cult, they're next. I heard their leader is this famous writer, Alan Wake. Their unholy motherfucking messiah. Sounds like a load of bull. Yeah, to be honest, me too. I can't really imagine Alan being that great as a messiah, if I'm perfectly fucking honest. Oh, dear. The trail disappeared under the rubble. Oh. I had a feeling something was waiting there. Oh, creepy. That's very fucking creepy, isn't it? Okay. So we need to... Um, we need to alter that, presumably. Collapsed tunnel. We've got another plot board thingy. So have we done that now? Yeah, that's changed. Okay, doorway to the underworld. Uh-oh. That doesn't sound great, does it? Let's be perfectly fucking honest. Do we really want to be creating portals to an underworld, Alan? By the way, guys, if you haven't, I mean, this is a, a shameless bit of self-promotion, but if you haven't listened to um, the uh, Not the Same Log episode I did with uh, Jack Graham and Elliot Chapman on uh, In the Mouth of Madness, John Carpenter's In the Mouth of Madness, go listen to it, because it really does have ramifications for this. It, it's interesting. The metaphysics is oddly similar. Oddly similar, I would say. I wouldn't be surprised at all if this draws direct inspiration from it in all honesty oh there's another thingy now how do i get you to fucking work i need to look at you from a particular angle don't i to get you to not this angle clearly to get it to function i need to look at it in a particular way i can't at the moment though it won't let me interesting Okay. So what do we do? Hmm. I like this. This this is the kind of shit I wanted from the original game, but which it didn't really get much of. There we go. Thank you. Source of inspiration. Yeah, thanks, Alan. I, I get it. What do you know where it is? Your research can help me, ma'am. What do you know? There's more than one urban legend about the cult of the word. 
Interesting. A nickname for the devil himself. It was disturbing finding myself in the story this way. But I was desperate. And it felt right for the story. Hang on. There's been a lot of stuff about doppelgangers. There's been a lot of stuff about doppelgangers in this. And that suggests to me the fact that Alan has written himself into the story. That does suggest that there's another Alan. There's a dark Alan somewhere, right? We could even be it, you know? We just don't know. We don't know what's what's happening. Uh-oh. Ah, can we change this? Yeah, so we changed it once. Let's change it back. There we are, so we can get through. There we are. Wonderful. Okay. Hmm. Oh, there's a word of power. Thank you. Let me guess. There's going to be a fucking... Yeah, I thought so. Go fuck yourself. Okay. Now, where do we go... Oh, am I going to have to turn it back to get out? I might. No, there's a door. There's a door. I can just uh, go away, go away, go away, go away. Ah, ha, ha, ha. ah fuck! <laughs> that was a mistake. Oh, you're a real one. Cool. God damn it. Oh, shit. Come on, Alan. There we are. There we go. Oh, fuck, he's a real one too. God damn it. Didn't realize. Okay, I need to heal. What have I got? Um, let me have a look. What, where's my... Hang on, where's me... Uh, that'll do. Heal. Yeah, pop those pills, Alan. Pop those pills. That's going to help. Okay, so... That's cool. I, I assume I've got to go down that side uh, exit now. That would be my guess, anyway. Like, down here? Right, yes! Yes! There we the go! The way forward was open. Thanks, Alan. I, I needed that. Cheers, mate. Cult of the Word. Shrine Street Platform. Oh, dear. What the... The wheel had been jammed in place and turned until the oil gurgled and flowed thick and flammable. The warning lights were blinking in a fast rhythm, bright and steady, powered by the battery. The Kasabian CD was playing in the boombox, all distorted guitars and intense beat. High above, some piece of orbital junk or another collided with the satellite, knocking it radically off course. Night Springs doesn't exist. It's a fictional town from the TV show I used to work on. It was Any Place USA, a place we used as a backdrop for whatever strange story we had that week. One of the stories I wrote for the show involved the man, the champion of light, fighting off his evil double, the Herald of Dark. That's what it's going to come down to, isn't it? There's going to be an evil Alan Wake, right? He's already done it. He's written himself into the story, so that's what it's going to be, yeah? Um, he didn't think writers were particularly useful people. He'd be right. Um, and a huge manhunt for one stuck him, stuck him. Uh, that's a, that should be struck, shouldn't it? Struck him as idiotic. Certainly not worth the missed opportunity for coffee and pie. Ah, Twin Peaks. It wasn't even clear what the man had done, except run from them at the trailer park. Mulligan knew he wasn't alone. The sheriff's patience with the Fed was running out. Okay. Oh, hello. Yay! Loot! We like that. 
Or not, because if it's given as loot, that suggests a combat section, doesn't it? Hello. What's going on? What? Humming. What? Are we going to meet someone else? I want to meet that janitor again, actually. I liked him. Oh, hello! In case you don't remember again. Well, I remember you. Remembering more now. It's good to hear, man. Hmm. Is it though? Is it though? Because like, what are you doing here? I'm not sure I trust any of this bullshit. How's your search for Mr. Door going? It's not great. This dream we're in. Putting a lot of roadblocks in my way. Yeah, yeah, tell me about it. Um, you think, so this, you is think a dream? this is a dream? I'm not ruling it out. <laughs> you know, my dreams have always been incredibly vivid. They feel real until the second I wake up. You know, in the dreams, I'm often someone else. A different person with a different name living a different life in, in a different world. I kind of love this. Maybe. Brilliant. I mean, it's just throwing all of this ambiguity at you at once. I love it. Like? Oh, okay. So he's a constant. The sketch you have does look like the door I know. The talk show host. All I know is the door has something to do with what's happening to me. And he knows that I know. Yeah, that's very sinister. Thank you. Mastermind torturing me. Interesting. Okay. So who is he, this door guy? So, I think we've done this one. I was at the morgue. I was about to give evidence to the FBI. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've seen this. What is this place? A dream. Feels like it, not real. No place, every place, all places, any place. Now New York, not New York City. A way to other places, a nexus. Is door the gatekeeper or trying to get somewhere, everywhere? Door, gate, portal, port, opening, access, window. Yeah, yeah, I mean, it's hard to say, isn't it? I mean, what exactly is he? Facts. Missing time, no memory, abducted dreams, me but not me. Others I know, yet they are different. The red-headed woman. Who's the red-headed woman? We, I don't think we've encountered that yet. And what's this thing? Is that a map? I'll take that, thank you. I'm sure that's going to be useful. I mean, thus far, it's been pleasantly linear, you know? There's been some open exploration, but not too much. It hasn't sort of overstayed its welcome. Pathfinding hasn't been that hard. But, let's see how we go, eh? It could get more tricky as time goes on. Ooh, okay. So that's the way we came in. What's through here? We're just going to leave the police officer with the gun, are we? That's fine. He could be most useful, but, you know. Let's just leave him here. Let's just leave him alone. That's an old video game reference, by the way, if you get that. Let's just leave him alone. And it's very niche. Very niche. No words of power around here? Okay, man. Um, I think we're done, mate. I'm going to leave you to it. Have fun searching for Mr. Door. Ooh. Ooh, it's all creepy and weird around here. Uh-oh. Oh, the music's gone. That's great. There's a map there. Stop it! Fucking horror games and their sound design. Jesus. I think that more than anything else, more than anything else, is what freaks me out in horror games. Sound design. Ah, oh, interesting. Yeah, okay, okay. I'm getting it, I'm getting it, I'm moving, I'm moving. Uh oh. Ah! Fuck you! Get you like a fucking ghostbuster, you asshole. 
Yeah, that actually kind of scared me. I don't know whether you noticed. Go back. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, there he is again. What is that? Oh, hello. Cynthia Weaver worked hard following her obsessive rituals. Sometimes fighting them, always giving in to them in the end. She haunted the halls of Bright Falls' abandoned power plant. She was preparing defences and supply lines for the war she knew would come. The war between forces of light and darkness. Cynthia was a character from the original Alan Wake. She was a bit like the log lady from Twin Peaks. She knew it was coming, like this, this darkness, and she was preparing for it. She was like stockpiling stuff. It was really weird. Mr. Randolph liked Rose, that little smile she had. How she was still sweet when life had tried so hard to make her bitter. It wasn't any of his business what she did in her trailer, but those strangers, the writer and his smart ass sidekick, looked like trouble. And they'd been here for hours, way past her normal bedtime. He reached for the phone and called the sheriff's station. Uh oh, Agent Nightingale! Agent Nightingale didn't want to be in Bright Falls. Um, these little communities revolted him, and he didn't like trees or the coffee. <laughs> he now knew uh, that impossible horrors lurked behind the storefronts and smiles. He desperately wanted to turn the car around and drive until he passed out or ran out of road and booze. But he had a job to do. He had a writer to catch at any cost. Oh, I, I knew it! I heard it behind the fucking door! Go away, asshole! Oh, he's fast! Oh my god! Ah! Ah! I've never seen that before! That's fucking horrible. Isn't it? That's re- Oh! Oh, that's really clever. Oh, it's brought me all the way back to the this point, has it? Surely not. This is way, way back. Surely it's saved before here. That's really weird. Or maybe it didn't. I don't know. Maybe it didn't. That's really strange. I need, uh, I think I need more pills, actually. Hang on. Yeah. I'm going to need some more health if we're going to do this properly. God, that's really strange. There's the edge of the story. Was that meant to happen? I wonder. I don't know. It feels weird that it didn't save anything before that, you know? So we've got the word of power. That's good. Is there anything else that we need to pick up? Or anything else that we need to get around here? I don't think there is, is there? We can just sort of move on. Does everything stay? Were a maze. Yeah, thanks, Alan. The Cheers. Trail led me on. That's not going to stay open, is it? So we've got to... We've got to do this again. All right, that's fine. I can handle that, but I wonder... Another place to use in this story. Yeah, thanks. I wonder why it didn't I save. That's really strange. Visions. Inspiration for the story that would lead me deeper. Go on, then. Do it. Change it, Alan. You're God, after all, apparently. And with that, the dark place changed. The federal agent had come here looking for answers. All he found was a fate worse than death. They had love to be on his case. <laughs> the cold can get you anywhere with that black magic shit. Let the day ship handle it. What happened, anyway? Some fed came looking for the cult. Yeah, blah, 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 blah. We know, we've seen it, we've heard it. Okay, now. Which way do we want to go? Hiya! Another echo lingered here. A source of inspiration. Eat lamp, motherfuckers. What do you know? Word is your research can help me, ma'am. What do you know? There's more than one urban legend about the cult of the word. Yeah, 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 we know. Yay! Which is, of course, a nickname for the devil himself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was disturbing finding myself in the story this way. 
<laughs> I was desperate. Was it, Alan? Perfect. Get off. Get off. Fuck. Ah, oh, fuck. Ah, oh, fuck. Oh, I'm having difficulty now. Fuck. Fuck. Oh, they're not letting me get up. Hang on. That's just, uh... Oh, shit. I think I might be fucked. Hang on. I was going to say, if I can outrun them, that's what I'm going to fucking do. God, look at him looping along. He's such a... I mean, this is actually much closer to what Alan is supposed to be. I mean, in the first game, there was a problem with him seeming a bit too like an action hero. You know? He was There was too much sort of Resident Evil, Chris Redfield shit going on. Um, this makes much more sense. This makes way more sense. Let's use that. Come on, Alan. This is going to take a while, but come on. Get yourself done, mate. There we are. That's better. Okay, now, can I... Uh, have I got anything else I can equip? Um, hang on. Quick slot uh, there. What's this? Handgun ammo? No, that's no good. Trauma pad? Oh, hang on. Let's put that... Quick slot. Let's put that there. There we are. Haven't I got my gun quick slotted? Jesus Christ, that's not clever, is it? There we are. I'm very surprised that we didn't save it before. It didn't save itself, to be perfectly honest. Maybe the save points are getting fewer and farther between as you go on. That's sort of the point, right? I don't know. I mean, if you want, you can bypass him. You can just leave the guy in there, and that, I imagine, would change the nature of the game, right? If you didn't talk to him here, wouldn't that change the story a little bit? Tim Breaker. In case you don't remember again. I wonder how long I'm he's been here. I'm remembering more now. It's good to hear, man. Come How's on, then. Blah, 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 blah. It's not great. Yeah, Skip, we've done it. We know this. this. So you think blah. this is a dream? I'm not ruling it out. Blah, we know. The sketch you have does look like the door I know. The talk show host. All I know is the door has something to do with what's happening. I like Mr. Door. I think he's a really interesting character, actually. Um, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, 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 blah. I'll take the map. That's sure to be useful. Alrighty. We got anything over here we can pick up or use or anything like that, do we? No, sadly not. So when's the next save point, I wonder? Because they've they've been very few and far between. And there's no, like, coffee thermoses anywhere or anything like that. There's a little mug there, but I don't think that's quite the same. So I'm going to have to be really careful of that one behind the door. Like, really careful, because he moided me last time. And I mean, absolutely did a number on me, so... And I've only got the little gun, haven't I? I haven't got, like, a shotgun like Saga had. Nothing? Nothing? Alright, so we know there's one over here. And there's one behind the door. Scratch, yeah. Bye! And we've got the turn back thing here, yeah, it's scary. Okay. He's right behind the door. That didn't work. Oh, fuck. Okay, but we did... We did, um... Get the shadow off of him, so that's good. Yes! Look at that, that was my phone, by the way. Excellent. No, that was good. That was good. So you can actually do that through doors. That's good to know. Hello. What have we got here? Anything? Nothing? Nothing. All right. Anything at all? Are there any, like, words of power knocking about? A save would be nice at this point, I can tell you. Ah, hello. Ah! Oh, we were so close to a fucking save. <laughs> Oh, look at... What is that about? I don't know, but there's something nearby. Can you hear it? You lost. Hello? Hello? 
Interesting. And have you noticed the TVs look are getting more advanced as you go along? That's a slightly more like early 2000s TV with a DVD player built in. That's really interesting. I like that. Ooh, pills. Yeah, we'll have those. Another horror game staple. If there are pills, take them. Always take the pills. Okay, well. There's... What is with that? The fucking dartboards turn up everywhere. Right, I'm going to quick save it, I can tell you. Well, my loves, that was a fun session, wasn't it? When we come back, we're going to delve deeper into whatever the frigging hell Alan's writing here. Until then, bye-bye. <laughs>